Good morning. Today's question is on the pH script. What is this? It measures the alkalinity or the acidity of your urine or saliva. This is the question. What is more accurate or what is better to monitor my saliva versus the monitoring my first urine in the morning? Okay, a couple things. Saliva has bacteria. If your mouth, if you're sleeping all night, then it might throw, I mean, you can monitor your saliva, but the bacteria might change um, the alkalinity or the acidity of your saliva, especially if you drink some water before you monitored your saliva. The pH in your urine is a little bit more accurate, I should say, only because you've been sleeping all night and all these byproducts have been forming all night. And then when you go first potty of the day, then it's the max amount of compounds, uh, pH and uh, toxins and so on and so forth that you will recognize in your um, urine. So first, first urine of the day, 15 seconds. So you would, let me show you what's in here real quick. I think you already know, but let me just show you. Little bag, and there's a few things. Travel case, just in case you want to take it to work or you don't want to carry the whole bottle. And then of course there's the whole bottle. On the side or in the back of the travel case, you have your um, ranges. And also, if you get confused and you need a bigger version, you can look at your box as well. So then you take your pH strip and then you put this against your color chart. Ah, that was loud. Okay, and of course, I haven't done anything with this, but anyways, and then you look and see exactly where that might be. Okay, now with the holidays coming up, I have to tell you, it's gonna be crazy. The sugar content, the alcohol, the type of food you're eating will change your pH. Very important that you keep your pH between 6.5 and 7.5. Number one, osteoporosis. Number two, Alzheimer's. We need to keep that pH within normal limits and the absorption of everything causes a change in your pH as well. So, you know, brain health, body health, heart health, every type of health. I'll catch you next time. Thanks for watching.